if you keep bombarding a wall with radiation over time that wall is going to start to slowly break down. Hey guys, it's Michaela Z at Your Moon Mom, and I recently sat down with Dr. Rusty, who's a neurologist that specializes in child development and is an expert in environmental toxins. So we've seen some pretty big names like Joe Rogan and Kennedy talk about EMFs and how they're piercing the blood-brain barrier. Dr. Rusty explains what the blood-brain barrier is and what EMFs are actually doing to affect our bodies. You know, this incredible, miraculous thing called the blood-brain barrier and which is composed of cells that operate electromagnetically. It's trying to let through some stuff and not let the bad stuff through. When it's affected chemically or physically by the EMF, it affects the functioning. So it can't protect. If you keep bombarding a wall with radiation, over time, that wall is going to start to slowly break down. This is so interesting. So basically what Dr. Rusty is saying is that our blood-brain barrier communicates electromagnetically, as well as many other functions in our body. So when we are constantly being exposed to this electromagnetic frequency, that's like a language to our body, but it's foreign. Our body responds to that as an attack. So when we are around man-made electromagnetic frequencies consistently every single day, it's constantly knocking on those barriers and breaking it down or causing holes, causing openings to allow for other environmental toxins and chemicals to flow into the parts of our body that they shouldn't be. So things that shouldn't be getting through are now getting through, which further worsen the effects on the brain okay. and nervous system. Yes. To find out more about EMS and how to protect your family, click the link in the bio.